Hey everyone, I'm back and I'm back with a small little haul. Um, but first of all, let me show you what I am wearing on my eyes. I know that you guys are going to ask. Um, I'm just using the Wet n Wild Trio and this one is in Cool as a Cucumber and it looks like this. If you guys want to see a tutorial on this, please let me know and I will do one for you guys. And also, I know you guys are going to ask what I have on my nails. It's Ulta's Coral or Cabana Coral. And it looks like this. I showed this in my Ulta haul, I think, last weekend or the weekend before. I'm not too sure, but it was a few days ago. So that's what I have on my nails. So with that said, let's go ahead and start with the haul. I went to Bath & Body Works, and I noticed that they had a few new scents from the um, their candle line or whatever so I chose two of them you guys know that I love burning candles and just a little review on these candles right now I'm burning mint chocolate um, yeah it's mint chocolate you can see I burned quite a bit of it and as you can see it burns evenly all the way around the candle I've experienced a lot of candles where they just burn right in the middle of it which I don't like because you basically waste a bunch of product on that but these candles burn evenly and you don't waste a thing so and they smell really good and true to the scent so um, I just picked up two the first one being cotton candy I think this is a new scent because I haven't seen it there at all and I think they only had like a few at my location so this one smells exactly like cotton candy with a bit of like lemon citrus scent to it so it's like a sweet but citrus scent it smells really good so I think I'm gonna go back and try to get one more or two just in case they discontinue these because you know with these new scents they usually just bring them out for promo and they see if um, it sells out fast or not, then they'll bring it back as a um, permanent scent. So. The other one that I got is Salty Caramel. I know it doesn't, it doesn't sound too good, but it smells so good. It smells exactly like the kettle corn that you would buy at Disney California, if you guys know what I mean, or if you know, or, or if you've been there. It smells exactly like that. It smells like the kettle corn popcorn. So that one again is Salty Caramel. And these ones were not on sale, but I had asked the cashier um, if they were still for 2 for 20 and um, she said they weren't, but she still gave me the promotion anyway, so you guys might want to ask the cashier before um, purchasing it for 19 bucks, which I would not pay 19 bucks for it. And on top of that, you know, you, they give you coupons and all that. If you spend 30, you get 10 bucks off and all that stuff. So you end up getting a really good deal in the end. So the last thing that I got from there was, I don't know if you guys seen these, but these are the stackers. They come in a few scent, scents. I think it's Moonlight Path, Sweet Pea, um, Citrus, I don't know, it's like a, it's a green one, but, and this one, the Japanese Blossom. So they only come in a few, but basically these are just little stackers that you take them off, and this one is just um, the spray. It comes with the little lotion and it comes with a body wash and I think this is like 15 bucks at first I thought okay three for 15 meaning like three of these entire sets but it's one two and then three so it was I don't know I think it's pretty expensive for just this but good thing I had a 20% coupon but I just got it because it's travel you know friendly you can take it when you go travel and you can put it in your purse or whatever you know just enough for a few days so yeah I got Japanese cherry blossom 
And I also got a free travel size item. So I chose the Cherry Blossom Body Lotion. Okay, so that is it for Bath & Body Works. My next um, store that I had gone to was Walgreens. I was looking for these baked um, blushes by Milani. Um, I love, this is the one that I've been using. This one is Nuance by MAC. And it looks like this. You guys can see that there's no longer that dome and it's hitting pan. I've used this so much. But with this um, mineralized blush, it actually works as a contour blush and kind of a bit of a highlight because it has that sheen to it or that, um, I don't know, that little um, shine. So I don't know if you guys can see that, but I've used it so much. And these are pretty pricey. I think these are like 23 or $22. So that's pretty expensive and I don't even think they make nuance anymore but I came across a dupe for those and these are the Milani um, baked blushes and they look like this and this one is Berry Amour and as you can see on there it says shapes contours and highlights so this also works as a three and one um, blush. So I thought that was really good. And it looks like this, exactly like the MAC mineralized blushes. And this one also comes with a mirror and it comes with a little um, brush, but I never use them. So. And it's half the cost. These are like $7.49 compared to max, which is like $23. So, very dupable. So I got this one in Berry Amour. I got this one in Bellissimo Bronze. And it looks like this. I also got Rose de Oro. Looks like that. Let me swatch. These are really pigmented too, if you guys are wondering. See, that's the swatch right there. And I'm actually wearing it on right now, if you guys can see. But I like it a lot. And the last one is Luminoso. And that one looks like that. I will put pictures and swatches up at the end of this video or somewhere in this video. So, um, yeah, I think those are a really good deal. I, I like it. I'm wearing it right now. And I would definitely go back and pick up more. I'm not too sure. I think there's like about six of them or eight of them. But I got four. And I like them a lot. So if you guys ever do come across these at your Walgreens, I would definitely pick up one. If you guys like to bake blushes and, um, or MSFs or whatever, I love anything that's baked um, makeup products. I don't know. I just like it on my skin. It doesn't irritate my skin. I know with some people... It leaves those like little bumps on their skin, but with me, it doesn't. I like it. Um, and if you think about it, it's half the cost of a MAC one. So, yeah, I thought those were pretty cool.
And the last two things that I um, came across were these Kiss um, lashes. And it says here that they are new. I got these ones in 07. And the cool thing that I noticed with these is you see that little red string on there. You basically hold it at each end and um, kind of measure it over your eye. So it says here you get a perfect, um, perfect application every time. So I thought that was cool. I don't know. I can't wait to try these. These were actually $3.99, which is a bit more than I would like to spend on lashes, only because you only use it for so many times and then you toss them. But I picked up two of them. This one is 07, and then this one is 05. And they look like that. So I will let you guys know, or I might even do a video on how to apply um, these lashes. So with So with that said, I think that's everything that I hauled for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed everything that I showed you. If you guys have any questions on any of the items, please feel free to leave it down below. Again, thanks for watching. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!